Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscription button. And if you're returning, hey girl, hey. Now today I have another haul video for you. Yes, your girl found some awesome books. <laughs> um, my local library was having a book sale. And I guess, you know, after a certain amount of time, they have to discard some things or they have like overstock. And with this, books were like a dollar or less. But on this day, when we went for our Wednesday um, library day, sale was actually $2 a bag. Fill your bag for just $2, whatever you can stuff in your bag. I was like, oh my God, I wish I was here by myself. <laughs> I would have been able to grab so much more because DJ was getting a little antsy and tired. But... I was able to find some great things. Now I so suggest that you check out your local library and see if and when they do their sales. I'm telling you, you can find some awesome things. Wait until the end of the video where I show you something that I've been looking for maybe 20 something years from my childhood. <laughs> so now let's just jump right into this haul because I've got a lot to show you. First up we have a book on colors. Meet Lucky, The Alphabet Tree, so love that, you know, vocabulary words for him, like things that'll definitely grow with him, A little activity of unscrambling, I am now top schooling him, so these are great resources to have, The Little Duck, a nice little easy reader, and some of these books, they're just gently used. Another little easy reader for him. Again, vocabulary words. This one has the actual definitions. Barnaby. Another one of the readers, but more advanced. Something that will definitely grow with him. Mouse Chase. Shout out to all of my 80s babies out here. <laughs> who remembers Fraggle Rock? Now this was the legend of the dozers who didn't. Oh my goodness, what's a Fraggle? <laughs> because our kids won't know what a Fraggle. Fraggle Rock doesn't come on TV anymore. <laughs> now we have Animal Babies. This is really cool. Little Kids, Na Nas Little kids National Geographic. The Monarch Butterfly. The Chimpanzee Family. The Magic School Bus, A Snake Mistake, this is a cool book, and then Amazing Animal Activities in the back. First I had to get, find a book on dinosaurs, Moth or Butterfly, This or That, Planet Earth, Learn About Our World, The Galapagos Tortoise, they even have a little activity, Word Detective. And in the back we have a glossary, so it's really cool. Next up we have Zoodles. This is a little magazine about bears. It also includes activity pages for children and resource center for grown-ups. Here's the website for you guys. This Zoodle features letter T and in and out. Really cool. Definitely going to have to see if I can build on this collection. We have another one about dolphins and the letter D. We have Under the Sea in 3D. Really cool. Now, luckily, we have 3D glasses from a little packet that I got for DJ from my Dollar General haul. If you haven't seen that one, I'll link it up top so you can check that one out. Oh, I love golden books. So we found Over in the Meadows to add to our little golden book collection. Another golden book, just is missing the gold foil. Peter Cottontail is on his way. So sick. Oh. Another old school classic, Wuzzles, Butter Bear Plant and Plants a Surprise. Kissy Fur and His Dad. Armadillo Ray, Dino Fours, It's Time for School, Bubble Bubbles, A Picnic with Blue, Blue's Clues. Like I said, this is book number 12, so we 
have something to build on and to look for. <laughs> oh my goodness. I was like, <gasps> when I saw this, Tigger comes to the forest. Look at that old school artwork. This is like one of the artworks from the original Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> Baby Duck's new friend. Not the piano, Mrs. Melody. Open wide. Tooth school inside. This book was so weird. I had to have it. Alistair in Outer Space. This book is really cool. It kind of teaches, you know, you should always return your library books on time. Because he gets abducted by space aliens on his way to return his school, his library books. The Biggest Boy. This is a cool little story. It's about a little boy that's growing up. And he now, the book I've been looking for forever. <laughs> Miss Nelson is Missing. OMG. I remember reading this or having this book read to me. It had to have been in like first grade or kindergarten. A bad class who never listens to their teacher. And then one day... They get a mean old nasty substitute that comes and it just keep. oh my goodness. It was such an awesome, I remember it was just such an awesome story. <laughs> I can't wait to read this to DJ. I saw this, I just almost lost it. When I tell you I've been looking for this book for like forever, forever. <laughs> Even when I was a kid, I wanted to read this book again and could never, ever, ever, ever find it. So I'm super excited to have this in our collection. And if you remember this book, please comment below of when you read it or if you have it in your library. So again, guys, thank you so much for clicking on my video. If you enjoyed this haul, please give us a thumbs up and definitely return. Hit that subscription button and that bell button so you get a notification whenever I post a video. And I hope you stick around and I hope you enjoy until next time, stay positive.